All right, everybody, it's Carl Eric here, and uh, today I'm gonna make a basic tutorial with uh, Sony Vegas. To know the basic stuff to do when you open Sony Vegas, and to know what to do, because Sony Vegas can be complicated, but at the same time it can all also be easy. So, first of all, I'll show you a very important one, like a part. So, how to import your your file, the video, because uh, without that you're not going to go far. So this here is. Uh, can help you right here is your files so this can help you to go through and look around see what you, you want right, I'll go in uh, my document I'm gonna look for my folder I'm gonna take uh, this video right here and you can double click which will bring it right up there or you can also drag it just like that it's up to you and to make sure you have the right one you can just press play right here on the screen, on the screen there you can see if that's the right file and look at it all right now uh, with this here your your video first Here's uh, some pretty easy commands. Uh, here you have a record. Here you can uh, loop the playbacks. With this one here, the start with the bar in front. This helps you. Like it's it's good if you have a big video. You just click that, and it'll go directly to the beginning. So that's good. This one here, you just makes it play, pause, stop. And this one, you you can change frames, videos by videos if you have a lot, or by frames, slowly. All right. So another good one to know, good thing to know is that you just let's say you don't need all of your video, you need to split like the middle or something like that. You click on the middle where you want it, and you you press S on your keyboard. Now split your video. Okay, if you don't want that, and you want to cancel this, what you just did, press Control Z. That will go back in the future. All right, and uh, another good thing, if the video is not, uh, if there's some stuff you don't need in it, this what you can do is also make it shorter, like this. You just press at the end and you drag it to the where you need it okay and uh, so that's uh, that's good also let's say you're done okay we're not you go in files and here you can save or save as you can open files that you had here it's to render that's if you're done with it and uh, you want to make it a video okay, if you want to capture it directly from a camera or from a CD okay and here you have a bunch of stuff you can look around those to get used to them okay and uh, this here is pretty cool you can make it make the video go slower or faster by bringing the arrows left and right we can manage to anyway okay so in this thing you have a lot of things you have this here helps you to make it uh, the colors fade so you can try if you want to make a night effect from the a day you have a bunch of stuff here you can play with them with the, the sound or let's say you don't want the sound on the track you just Oh, by the way, this is with a video. It's called video track. Under, it's uh, audio track. You can also add pictures, stuff like that. Like I was saying, if you don't want the the audio, you just an easy way to do it is just right click, 
you, or you can rename it you can duplicate it right here but here you can delete so there we go so now we don't have the, the sounds of the annoying cars going by